Set number seven for our daily math quiz. We only have five items in this set kasi medyo mahaba yung babasahin nyo. Kapag ayaw nyo sa math, di nyo pa nababasa, mukhang mahirap na. Lalo na pag word problems na katulad nito. Pero, ang advantage sa mga magaling sa English, intindihin nyo lang yung given. Huwag nyong pangunahan yung sarili nyo na di nyo kaya kasi kaya nyo at kakayanin nyo. Number 1. Roberta takes 58 with her on a shopping trip to the mall. She spends 18 on her new shoes and another 6 on lunch. How much money does she have left after these purchases? Ilan yung natirang pera niya? So to answer this question, subtract each amount of purchase from $58 niya. So $58 minus $18 and you have $40. Tapos minus $6 and that is $34. So, ang sagot ay letter A, 34. Number 2. On a four-day trip, Carrie, or whatever Carrie, <laughs> drove 135 miles for the first day, 213 miles the second day, 159 miles the third day, and 189 miles the fourth day. Which of the following choices is the best approximation of the total miles Carrie drew, drove during the trip? Meaning, i-add mo lang ito lahat. So, i-add natin. 135 135 plus 213 159 189 1,2,3,4,5,6 and the answer is 696. Ngayon, best approximation. 996 malapit siya sa 700 and the answer is letter B. Number 3, while bowling in a tournament, Jake and his friends had the following scores. Si Jake, 100. Uh, 89, Charles and Max uh, each scored each 120, and Terry 95. What was the total score for Jake and his friends at the tournament? I-add mo lang 189, tapos each scored 120, dalawang 120, that is 240. Then, 95. So, you have... 524. So, the answer is letter C, 524. Number 4. The drivers at G&G Trucking must report the mileage on their trucks each week. The mileage reading of Ed's vehicle was 20,907 at the beginning of one week and 21,053 at the end of the same week. What was the total number of miles driven by Ed that week? I-minus mo lang siya. 21,053 minus 20,907. So, ang haba ng mga sinusulat niya. Mag-minus lang pala tayo. So, this is 6, 4, 1, and ito na. 146, 146 miles, letter C. Number 5. In a downtown department store, Angelo finds a woman's handbag and turns it into the clerk in the lost and found department. The clerk estimates that the handbag is worth approximately 150. Inside, she finds the following items. Merong 65 na makeup. 75 na perfume, 150 na earrings, at saka cash na 178. The clerk is writing a report to be submitted along with the found property. What should she write as the total value 
of the found cash and property. So, ipang-add mo lang yan, lahat. So, 150 plus 65 plus 75. So, itong 150 para madali, that is 300. So, itong uh, 65 plus uh, 75, that is 140. Itapos, 178. And you have 1, 2, 3, 618. So the answer is letter C, 618.